We know that if you have positive TPO and you're pregnant, your chances of having a miscarriage increase. Your chances How of, much? Mm, I, 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 would, I think that in different series will have different numbers, but it's not insignificant. Okay, I, I will have to get back to you on the on how much is increased, but and there's also increased chance of prematurity, just because the TPO posi- antibody is positive, even so, without rise in TSH, without hypothyroidism, exactly. So that in itself is a demonstration that something either the is TPO is doing something on its own, or. Uh, it's a, it, its presence is associated with something else that we don't know. So it happens that autoimmune diseases, they they might come together with other autoimmune and, and diseases. And of course, in that situation, when you state it that way, it seems far more likely that it's the second of those two scenarios. The very same immune system that is now attacking the thyroid, which we can detect through the TPO, is also is doing, attacking exactly, the fetus. Exactly, is doing something else. Or because the, the fetus is foreign. The, or the placenta or, yeah. or whatever. And we know that patients that have TPO positive also uh, maybe 30% have positive antibodies against brain tissue, or different parts of the, the, the body. So do you know, uh, because obviously I know nothing about uh, obstetrics, is this something where now any woman in her first trimester is getting a TPO screen, if it's coming back positive, she's being shuttled to a high-risk uh, obstetrician? 